Well, Ben, Jen, the Board of Education here in Hamden voted to reinstate the governor's mask mandate in a 5-3 vote, but demonstrators who were rallying outside of the board's central office before the meeting in support of removing the mask mandate are disappointed in the move. Hamden Public School students will have to keep the masks on in the classroom, despite the governor's statewide school mask mandate ending Monday. In a 5-3 vote, the Hamden Board of Education reinstated the mandate. I think we can all recognize the importance of classroom learning and can agree that learning is best in school. This was made possible through wearing masks, advocating for vaccinations and boosters whenever possible. But some board members were opposed to reinstating the mandate. I just feel that's an unnecessary burden put on our teachers and our administrators to have to enforce something like that. Demonstrators rallied outside the board's central office before the meeting. Mask choice Hamden! I am opposed to my kid having to wear a mask. I am opposed to my child being forced to wear a mask. Fifth grader Alexio Celieris rallying with his parents Monday night. I feel like you should just have the choice whether or not you want to mask or not mask or, or that sort of thing. I feel like part of my identity is covered. The CDC no longer recommends universal masking indoors in schools located in areas with low or medium COVID-19 community levels. Governor Lamont says about 85 percent of schools have elected to end the mask mandate. He addressed the topic at a press conference Monday. Let, let, let the local superintendents working together with parents and teachers make the choice. Like I said, 85 percent are take it off the mask. The CDC no longer requires mask wearing on school buses, updating their guidance Friday. Now, the board's chair says they can revisit this topic or even reevaluate in April. As we look around the state, schools in New Haven, Waterbury and Hartford are also keeping masks on for now. Demonstrators tell me they plan to come back out here and raise their voices. We're live in Hamden tonight. Alicia Machado, Fox 61 News.